Rich, I want to make a video of day two at the expo. What do you think? Oh, don't you do it. <laughs> Come on, Rich. I want to make the video. Well, that works pretty good. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Not yet, Darren. Not yet. He runs all Tiger Cat. No, I'm just kidding. That's the kind of get around there. Got a Barco 495B. Oh no. That's right. He's got to show he's human once in a while. I think he did that because everybody thinks he's perfect. I got to give him credit for trying. He's got more courage than I do. So we're standing here watching the tire boss in action. Because apparently Josh isn't a good driver with full air pressure. <laughs> right, right. Gets yeah. stuck all the time. Actually. That can make a bad driver a good driver. <laughs> there you go. It really does. Because this guy was a bad driver. Oh, that's going on YouTube. Oh. Are you videotaping? No. Oh. See that where it's showing 21 seconds, 22 seconds? That's not video. Well, you don't so Donovan... This is El Boss Timber down in Chile. They had 90 Western Stars that they had shipped in at once and we did their trucks for them. They couldn't get around. They had terrible mobility in the clay, a real heavy red clay down there. We did up their trucks and you lower your tire pressure and they drive right through. Amazing product. Huh. Well, what a tire... What a salesman he's got even... Uh, sell on YouTube through me. <laughs> Do I get a commission? Yep. Alright. One lollipop a year. Canapop. Sweet! So this is the view out of the back of a 625 Tiger Cat. After I crack my elbow in the window here. The Scorpion. It's kind of a neat concept. I'm going to climb up in this 948. That's a lot of hood. I guess you can kind of see around there. James! I'm making a video at the moment. You want to say hi? Hey. It's pretty cool. Out of, I did a little video out of the back of that Tiger Cat. They kind of kind of have the same. Well, that's for watching your cartoons, apparently. Hmm. I see what you're talking about with the outrigger legs down there. Holy smokes! Well, I don't like that. Like Got the Barco. And the 7,000s hood over there. Huh? I was just talking to the guy that's back there talking to Don. He owns one of these. He bought the one that was in the expo a couple years ago in Bemidji. He absolutely loves it. Says it'll it'll really lift. Says it's a very good loader. But he's very happy with it. So that's good. The show's over, I guess. It is after two o'clock. Really it does. It's gonna to touch there, isn't it? You got a load of tree length leaving. A couple loads of tree length leaving. Heading out. <laughs> he waved. <laughs> I 
I don't know where that Barco was hiding. I didn't even notice that. Huh. Must be blind. I suppose I could follow the tracks back. I better get my pickup out of here before somebody runs into it. Do it. I had the spotlight. You had the spotlight. Okay, you ready? Go ahead. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Hey, that's Derek. Street. Yeah, I'm terrible with names. Say it again. Derek Street. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, we should. I'm still recording while he's drinking his water. Derek's got videos on YouTube too. Check him out. Yep, on Crete Logging. Yeah.